So one of the largest U.S. insurance companies paid a $40 million ransom to hackers. $40 million. $40 million. Uh, so the Chicago-based insurance company, CNA, one of the largest insurance companies in the United States, paid a $40 million ransom. Uh, and this was in late March after hackers stole a trove of company data and they locked them out um, for nearly two weeks. So that's a long time to be locked out in like, I mean, a few days. That's tough. A week. All right. You know, a week and a half. Uh, okay, man, we, we got to figure this out. And that's on a 40 million. Two weeks, they're like, all right, we can't do this no more. So <laughs> two weeks, they paid him 40 million. I mean, they got to be set. I mean, they're obviously probably trying to track that money down and see you did it, but they're hackers and they got in there and did all that. It's dangerous, man. And, you know, companies all over the world are falling victim to this, this type of ha- hack. Like these type of companies are dealing with this. Um, I mean, they're becoming way more common. So, um, you know, where do we stand with this, man? I know a lot of people joke around and they say, I uh, I wish they would hack all our student loans. And do, man, they're going to have to hire, you know, anti-hackers or they're going to have to hire hackers to prevent hackers from hacking. This is craziest stuff. Craziest stuff. I... Man, how how do you do that? If it's a what if it's a hacker and they like they like backdoor it, and then they get back in, they hack back in. You know, I know like that. You know, government has hackers that they do and have all that, but that's a that's a that's a lot, man. That's a that's a lot to be dealing with. I don't I don't even know how you do that. Um, so you know, this Chicago company just said forget it, and they gave. Um, they gave these hackers $40 million. Um, I don't know, man. I mean, obviously these companies are making a lot of money. Maybe they have insurance on hacking and on cyber attacks because these cyber attacks are getting crazy, man. I mean, I think they did something with, uh, what do you call it? They, uh, did that pipeline cyber attack that messed that all up, caused a little break for a minute. People buying gas and all that. So, you know, you're seeing this more and more like it's becoming a thing. I don't know if you guys know the video game um, Watch Dogs. That's all that is. This is just real life Watch Dogs stuff. 